Hi guys, welcome back to my channel and in this video I will teach you how to make a generator from a mixer motor without any external power input. Now the mixer motors are usually the universal motors that can also be found in power tools. These motors are capable of operating both on AC and DC power supply. So guys, you might be noticing that I'm not pulling the thread fast enough. That is because the generated voltage will be too high and can damage the LED strips. So guys, before I get on with the video, I would like to share this great news with you about PCBWay which we all know is a Chinese PCB manufacturing company. Now the great news is the second PCB design contest that they are holding for all interested electronic engineers. Entries to the contest have already started so gear up guys cause the last day to post your project is 12th December 2018. So do your best because the prizes are great. Winners will be announced on December 19th, 2018. So guys, the universal motors are high RPM motors that usually operate at 230 volts or 110 volts AC or DC. But they are not generators unless they are modified. So let's open it up to start the modification process. So guys this is a small permanent magnet DC motor that can also generate electricity when rotated and as you can see it can generate 3 to 4 volts when rotated with hands.
So guys, what I've done here is I have mechanically connected the two motors together so that when I rotate the shaft of the universal motor, the shaft of the DC motor also starts operating and in turn the DC motor will generate small amount of electricity. A universal motor usually has four wires, two for the field and the other two are for the brushes. In some cases, the number of wires can be more than four, in which case you will have to find the two wires connected to the brushes and the remaining wires will be for the field winding. Now the two wires from the DC motor will be connected to the field winding of the universal motor. If you have more than two wires for the field winding, connect the output wires from the DC motor to any two wires of the field winding of the universal motor. The overall output of the generator system will appear on the wires connected to the brushes of this universal motor.